Ooh. Riddell, Zenith. We looking nice, my guy. Yes, sir. Ski is football Monday. What's good, certified gang? It's your boy Keiko, and I'm back with another video, back with another banger. Ding Dini. You feel me? Now, hey, thank you guys for showing so much love on the last previous videos, man. I told you guys, like, everything's a process in life, dog. Listen, if things are going slow and you feel like, you know what I'm saying, you're stagnant, just keep on going. Keep being consistent. And, bro, I'm telling you, you're going to see yours just manifest everything. But anyway, as you can see, we done brought the camera out. And as you can see, we're in the car. And you know if we're in the car, we are most likely headed to Compton College. This is your first time watching me. I'm a defensive back at Compton College, Duco product, Duco journey, all of that. Now that we got that out the way, you feel me? In my last video, uh, y'all saw my day in the life. It was supposed to be equipment day. I was supposed to get dripped out. I was supposed to get, you know, a little something, something. But the athletic trainer was not letting us breathe and not letting us be, you feel me? It wasn't even my fault. But today, we got the green light. You know what I'm saying? Today we got the green light. It's finally time to go, man. And as you know, today is August 9th. August 9th is my dad's birthday as well. So down below in the comments, tell my dad happy birthday. But anyway, man, like, bro, we have a game in literally less than a month, September 4th against ELAC. And from what I'm hearing, they're a pretty good school. You feel me? So it's about time they finally let your boy free and uh, get these pads, you feel me? So today is actual equipment day. The shoulder pads that y'all saw at the beginning of the video, those are the Xena Velocity 2s that Xena sent me. And I got also paired it with a, a Riddell backplate as of right now. Um, those are probably the pads I'm gonna be using for the season. Camp is started, like camp, it's time to go, you feel me? And if you guys are in camp, uh, hopefully you guys are watching this video, you're not cramping up watching it and nothing like that, you mostly relax. Um, but yeah, man, today I'm just gonna bring you guys along. I'm gonna vlog throughout the day because I gotta get equipment. Then I'm probably gonna get something to eat. And then after that, we got a uh, weightlifting and then we got practice. So it is a jam packed day, um, football day, football Monday, man, like I said. So with that being said, uh, I'm gonna take this drive. I'm gonna be safe on this drive. Y'all just stay tuned for the vlog, you feel me? Leave a like down below, subscribe to the channel if you're new, follow me on IG. And hey, if nobody told you today, man, I got hella love for you, man. We gonna get right into it, let's go. Another day, another dollar. Got my boy Alfred in the cut. Feel me? We are headed to the equipment room, man. Hopefully, today's the day, right? Today is the day, man. Today is the day they letting us strap up. Well, we not strapping up in practice, but we at least getting our stuff, bro. Oh, we we've been through a lot of stress trying to get to this point. You feel me? Last week we was here. We was here all day. Ain't nothing get resolved, but it sounds like terrible. everything. I know. But shit, you know, hey, patience sometimes gets you where you want to be. So that's what we had to do, and we're here today. Y'all seen all this before if you paid attention to the videos. But here's the weight room, you feel me? See Compton Tartars right there. Weight room is pretty big, man. A lot of y'all would underestimate a place like Compton College, man, but like, the weight room is pretty big. Over there is the basketball gym. Let me show you back here, man. This is where. This is where the magic happens back here, man. They got the little core and medicine ball area in here, bro. I'm telling you. I'm telling you, man. Don't play with Compton, man. But uh, right now, I guess we wait until exactly 11. Uh, my coach is in the coaching office, but I'm not finna film all that. And then I guess we about to go in there and pick out our equipment. I ain't finna show you everything. But I guess we gotta go right now. This is the coach's office, y'all boys, man. We got a lot of food in here. Couch where we do some learning. Got a lot of stuff out there, man. Got my boy RZ out there. Right now, we right in our position, our height of weight and everything like that. About to get out. Got everybody in here, you feel me? Boy Zion, my boy Brian. Yes, sir. So if I already didn't mention this, like I said, we just waiting right now to, uh, he called us back there, you know what I'm saying? But like I said, we got the green light. I ain't gonna show y'all what I get to like later or after, but this is gonna be a whole little vlog. So right there is where we go and certify gang, the equipment room. They're taking like each player one by one, so it's gonna take a little good minute, but some more players came, they back in there. And uh, man, like I said, I'm just ready to get it started, man. Like I said, at the end of the day, if you're watching this and you're a football player somewhere, I do feel like at a certain point, you feel me? Equipment does matter, you feel me? But if you look good, you play good, all of that, you know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, it don't really matter. You can be a dog with a bucket helmet, you know what I'm saying? It don't really matter at all, so. Um, 
We just waiting right now. So I'll catch y'all once we get in here and, and get our stuff. It's really worse in other places. Not for real. Like up near where I stay, it'd be 100, 100 degrees, bro. Like for real, for real. But hey, y'all. Uh, so I got my equipment. My helmet sitting right here on my lap. I'm happy with my helmet that I got. You know what I'm saying? But I'm not going to show y'all to the end of the video. So right now, uh, I think. This is the first time that we about to go uh, to Dick's as like, you know, with teammates and stuff. So it's me, my boy uh, Zion in the back, Jelani over here, my boy Alfred uh, got the wheel. But yeah, we about to go to Dick's real quick and see what they got. All right, y'all, so we pulling up right now. Dick's Sporting Goods, Cerritos, man, me and, the, me and the teammates, man. We about to see what they have in here. Apparently, this is a good store. All right, y'all, we in here, man. This Dick's is pretty big, bro. It's got two floors to it. It's looking very promising, man. This is my first time at this. I'm not about to show y'all boys everything just because a lot of y'all be saying, oh, you be going to Dick's and showing the same thing. So, um, you feel me? We're in the football section right now. Got some Under Armour socks, football socks. I don't know if I'm going to cop anything. We're over in the Vaza section right now. Look like my boy Jelani finna just cop him a clear drone. Just a clear one. Feel me? Oakley's got very, very nice quality. You know I mess with Next Trend. You know I mess with Shock, all of them, but it's Under Armour. These ones is on sale. You got, you got Nike right here. We're in the glove section now. A lot of it, to be honest, a lot of it is the same that I would see at any other digs, but some stuff I, you know, we ain't seen the American flag gloves. In my last video when I was at Dick's, y'all was talking about how I made fun of the American flag and all that. Bro, I just laughed. It wasn't nothing crazy, but yeah, it's nothing really too crazy. Look, these mats are like the burgundy perfect, bro. So these gloves right here that y'all seeing, bro, these probably match our colors, like Compton's colors perfectly, bro. Silver, like our helmets are silver and there's maroon too. So I don't know, man. I had to get those, but I don't think I'll ever wear them though. I don't know. Got some mouthpieces right here. I don't need none. Shout out to Next Trend. I don't need no mouthpieces right now. But they got Shock Doctor, Under Armour. Pretty sure they got Battle in here. Nike gloves. Like I said, I ain't gonna show y'all everything in here just because it's pretty much the same stuff. I'll probably show y'all the cleats. But other than that, like I said right now, but really, we just trying to waste time until we got to go back for practice and stuff. We probably going to get something to eat. What y'all think about these cleats, man? These are soccer cleats, $274. But they light as hell. I'm talking about super light. That's crazy. If you're watching this right now, hang out with your teammates outside of practice and everything like that, man. Get to know your teammates, man, because it's going to help you on the field. It's going to help you just in life in general. You never know who you meet or you never know. You know, you may have something in common with teammates. So. Hang out with your teammates. All right, y'all, so we in the mall walking around, trying to find somewhere to get some food. If you're wondering why we ain't on some sort of meal plan or nothing like that, it's because we play Juco football. They don't give you no meal plans, man, so you gotta find your own food, so. We in Cerritos Mall trying to find some food, bro. Good, he's got me some Mongolian barbecue, man. I'm about to go crazy on this. Yes, sir. All right, y'all, so it's been some time later, and now we're back in the football office with it, you know what I'm saying? Doing some stuff to our helmets, chilling. Oh, is that my helmet right there? Oh. But, uh, yeah, we just waiting right now. We got our equipment, so we just waiting until practice, really. So we just gonna be chilling here. Uh, practice start at five. We gonna get to it, man, like I said, man. Hopefully you guys are watching this and putting in some work with me. I know it's camp time, so it's hectic and everything like that, but. Uh oh, with a next trend visor. Hey, next trend. If you're watching this, shout out to me. It's an interview. So, so who on the team you wouldn't let date your daughter? Who would let date my daughter? Who wouldn't you let date your daughter? Who you? I mean, who you know? You probably don't know everybody on the team. All right. Well, JJ not one. JJ, why won't you let JJ? Oh, JJ. Oh, yeah. But why Why JJ? What, what's wrong with that name? JJ going to cry about it. Oh, okay. He going to get his feelings hurt about See, it. See, you should say nobody. See? I don't know. Nobody date your daughter. Canadian to me type of shit. So I 
Hey, bro, he's talking about that Canadian. Yeah. So, so, so if you had a kid one day, and then she come on with a nigga like him, what you gonna do? He just laugh at you like that. What you gonna do? Man, so, <laughs> Man. so, Man. hey, so, Damn. you would be the type to get money to be uh, getting money. Yeah, yeah, you betcha. Yeah. So a little bit of an update. I know I realize like sometimes in my vlogs I only be updating on y'all what's going on. I just do it and I'll be telling y'all after, but basically, so we're in the start of camp. So as of right now, offense and defense is gonna split up. For the first part of camp, uh, which is like five to like six something, uh, offense is gonna be in a meeting. And then basically after, uh, and, and then defense is gonna be lifting. And then basically after all that, we're gonna switch, you feel me? Defense is gonna be in a meeting, probably gonna watch film, learn some things. And then uh, offense, will be working out while we in film. So that's basically what's going on right now. I don't know if we actually going on the field right now, man. We still got a lot of players that's got to handle their business and get everything done. But uh, yeah, after uh, pretty much get done working out, um, I'm gonna have a meeting. And then after that, like when we get home and stuff, I'll show you like all the stuff that I got, uh, you know, for my team and stuff, so. Yes, sir. Three hours later. And that's a wrap, certified gang. So look, we just got out of uh, meetings and uh, weights barrel. We didn't go on the field and start doing uh, anything right now. Just because like I said, we are waiting for some people to uh, finish up their business. But it looks like towards the end of the week, we about to get on the field and start, and start doing this stuff. And start doing stuff, but you know what I'm saying? I can't let y'all know all the sauce. But just know we getting prepared for our first game against ELAC East Los Angeles College, man, September 4th. We at they crib with it. And uh, yeah, man, I, when I get home, I'm gonna show you guys my helmet. Uh, my shoulder pads and stuff like that my jersey number and all that it's not my like real jersey number this is just my practice jersey number so i don't know what my real number gonna be but uh yeah man we finna head to the crib right now and uh hopefully you guys are having a good day all right y'all boys i'm not gonna lie to y'all you feel me i went to straight to sleep last night like, straight to sleep you feel me i was at content all day so i was tired you feel me and i ain't show y'all what i got uh from the equipment room so I'm about to show you guys my equipment now. Small disclaimer before y'all see my equipment. A lot of y'all that's ungrateful. A lot of y'all that's super materialistic. Y'all finna be like, ah, oh, you feel me? It's all right. This, this, that. But listen, I'm grateful for anything. I'm grateful to get anything from a team. I'm grateful to be on the team. You feel me? Like, just in general, you know what I'm saying? But I'm about to show y'all what I got. And um, yeah, that's how we gonna end this video. First thing is first, you feel me? We got my shoulder pads. Now these shoulder pads, Compton didn't actually give me. These are Zenith shoulder pads, Zenith Velocity 2s that Zenith um, sent me. By the way, use my code MTF15 for 15% off of your purchase. But um, yeah, man, this is the practice jersey they gave me. This is a practice jersey. So I know a lot of you guys see the Russell right now and you see the, the Compton on there and everything and the number one. Number one is probably not going to end up being my number, you feel me? Um, I'm probably still going to end up being a single-digit number, but it's just a practice jersey. Number one, Russell, you feel me? Uh, got the burgundy numbers, black jersey with the little white on it, you feel me? These are practice jerseys. Listen, a lot of y'all don't be listening in these videos. A lot of y'all will just see things and then go straight to the comments. Listen, practice jerseys. The real jerseys are under armor, all right? So... Um, I'll stay tuned for the, that jersey reveal and everything like that. Damn, y'all saw this helmet earlier. This was my helmet, man. We have a Riddell Speed, you feel me? This is the original Speed right here. And when I put this on my story, a lot of y'all was sitting there saying, oh, this is a bucket helmet. That's a bucket helmet, you feel me? Listen, a Riddell Speed is still fire. Odell Beckham still wears a Speed. And as you can see, I'm sporting the next trend visor in there. Um, the all clear, John. I'm probably gonna end up wearing that in the game. But hey, apparently Next Trend got some stuff coming for me, man. I got uh, also uh, something coming with Invictus gloves as well. But bro, you got the burgundy face mask. Y'all probably can't tell on camera, it probably looks black, but that's really burgundy. Let me see if I could turn. Yeah, y'all see, see it's a burgundy face mask and then it's a silver 
feel me? Silver helmet. Um, but the Riddell Speed, I know a lot of you guys know I have a Speed Flex, um, but I would not be using that this season just because it is not this color. You feel me? I can paint it, but I ain't trying to go through all that, man. I'm going to just use this Riddell Speed, you know what I'm saying, and be happy with it. See the combo. Defense, I'm on the defensive side, so we got the uh, black jerseys. Offense got white. But this is pretty much all I got. I got a pair of pants, but they're in the car. Uh, they're a pair of Nike pants that they gave me. Um, they're like white and burgundy uh, to go along with it. But yeah, bro, that's pretty much all they gave me um, from equipment day. And I'm ready to get it started, man. We already had day one of camp. So day one of camp's over with. And uh, yeah, we just gonna keep going with this, man. So down below in the comments if you like these vlogs like this, but that's the end of the video because I gotta get ready and go do this all over again. Camp day two, man. I know a lot of you guys are in camp. Keep hydrated, keep safe, keep God first. And with that being said, that's in this video. Leave a like down below, subscribe to the channel if you're new, follow me on IG, and we out, dog.